Riding a bike with both a physical and visual disability can be difficult and in this vlog I'm going to be taking you through what it was like riding a bike as part of blind sport. Now I have done other videos in the past about bike riding and some of the struggles I face such as going fast, going on uneven surfaces or hills because of my physical disability and visual impairment but this time was more challenging for other reasons because I was in a big group of people who were also riding bikes with both different levels of vision impairments, some who were totally blind, some who had more sight than me, and obviously that makes it more challenging, us riding in a big group together who can't really see all that well, and then we were also riding in a public place, riding across Mungary Bridge as well as the other pathways around that area, meaning that there were people who were walking their dogs, people who had small children or other people riding bikes that we had to be wary of when riding. Now I stuck to the back and just kind of did my own thing a little bit with my mum running alongside me, making sure that I was safe, grabbing onto me when we went down steep hills and just helping me to get off my bike if I didn't want to ride, things like that. It was a bit scary, especially since I'd never been to that area before and wasn't really sure about what it would be like. So you can check out that full video if you want to see what it was like riding as part of Blind Sport. But in this vlog, I'm just going to be sharing some of my little experiences riding with a vision impairment and a physical disability with a big group of people because it does make it more challenging. Riding as a part of Blind Sport was definitely a very different experience to riding on my own with a big group of us all riding together. We had people who were totally blind riding tandem in front, whereas everybody else was a bit further back. I kind of did my own thing a little bit, riding at my own speed. I rode across Mungary Bridge, this big concreted bridge, which was a lot of fun to ride on. It was this big open space, allowing me to go as fast as I wanted, whereas bridges like this were a little bit more challenging just because of the uneven ground. I also struggled with hills, both going up and down steep hills. This made it more challenging, whether it was on concreted or uneven ground, it was still a bit difficult. However, I still enjoyed myself having a nice ride with my mum running alongside me, there to help me out if I needed her. Thank you so much for watching today's vlog. I hope that you found it helpful. If you enjoyed it, then don't forget to smash it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and ring that bell so you don't miss any new videos. Also, don't forget to share it with your friends, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!